So this is just a quick follow on from the last video to show you how <clears throat> everything powers up. So if I plug a battery in here to my, um, to my Pixel, you see you start getting a beep, the initialize. It won't get a GPS in here because uh, I'm inside. Okay, you can see the um, ground uh, mission planner has connected up. That's connected through this little radio modem. That's one end of it. And the other end is on the side there, you see. Okay. There's a, there's a receiver I was talking about earlier. This is for the Crossfire. I've got this radio, which is a um, Radio Master T16S. This is a very nice radio, very good value for money. And I've got this thing on the back, which is a Crossfire, which is very cool and very configurable. It's a, a, I'd, I'd really recommend that. It's a nice bit of kit. So that's long range and uh, very easy to set up. So, if you watch now, I press this, <laughs> this switch here, you'll hear everything come to life. Check the throttle is shut, <laughs> especially inside, because I've disabled all the arming checks, right? So it'll just go live. So I press that. Now that's live. Now, of course, I'm showing you this, so <laughs> probably won't work. But now the battery, that means the motors and servos and things are live. If I, if I hold this stick down and to the right, it should arm it. And there you go, it's armed and the motors are running. I can't, I can't tell you how, how happy I was the first time that actually worked. Now if I give it a little bit of throttle, you see, it's quite feisty. <laughs> I think the, the same thing works to disarm it. No. <laughs> okay. Maybe this. No. So the only way to disarm it, um, there is another way to do it, I forget now, but yeah, I can just hit here, arm disarm on the screen. You sure you want to disarm? And it stopped, you see? So that, that's what it should look like when everything fires up and works properly. I'll give you a quick scan over the, over the top to see how everything is connected there. You see? Obviously, I, as I said again, uh, before, it's all, it's all connected up, up on the outside of the aircraft, so it's easy to explain to people what's connected where. But, oh, Ideally, on a proper build, you want all this stuff inside the aircraft, obviously. Okay, so any questions, put them in the comments. Like, subscribe, share, all that kind of stuff. Thanks, and uh, bye for now. I'll be back in the, next, in the coming months with my, my next plane, but um, it's, it's going to be a bit of a winter hobby, I think. I've got too much other stuff to do in the summer. Cheers, bye for now.